model years after moving the Durango to the Mercedes-Benz based platform also used by the Jeep Grand Cherokee, Dodge has finally applied the 390-200 powered SRT treatment to the family sized SUV, giving us the 2018 Dodge Durango SRT you see here. It will make its debut at the 2017 Chicago Auto Show before going on sale this summer. This is the one I wanted to launch, Dodge Chief Tim Kiniskis says, referencing an auto journalist who has called the erstwhile performance trim level Durango RT the Threro Charger. Beside obvious design tweaks such as a new grille and copious air intakes up front, including an air duct from just above the fog lamps over the wheel openings and to the airbox. The 2018 Dodge Durango SRT gets the familiar 475 horsepower, 470 pound foot 6.4 liter Hemi V8 and 8 speed torque with light automatic transmission. The Durango SRT will come standard with full time four wheel drive and a viscous clutch. Kuniski cites a 4.4 second 060 miles per hour time and a quarter miler of 12.9 seconds. So why buy one of these instead of, say, a lighter and lower rear-wheel drive Dodge Charger SRT? The Durango SRT is the most capacious Threro SUV with the most legroom in the third row, the most cargo space behind the third row and, with a rating of at 8,600 pounds, more towing capacity than the Chevrolet Tahoe, says Kuniskis. The torque with flight is controlled by what Kuniskis calls a real shifter, a thandle instead of the modern electronic dial. Its crosshair free grille suggests the look of Dodges to come while the functional hood scoop and other front air intakes are there to provide maximum cooling, design chief Mark Trossel says. There's the obligatory 20 by 10 inch wheel spec with an available black noise finish that's not pure black, 392 badges on the front fenders, and a new lower rear fascia with dual 2 3 4 inch exhaust designed to emit a 392 charger like sound. Suspension tweaks include stiffer springs and Bilstein shocks. With a 50 to 48 percent front rear weight balance of roughly 5,510 pounds, the SRT Durango is very neutral and feels smaller than it is, Dodge says. Brembo brakes are 15 inch rotors and 6 pistons front. 13.8 inch and 4 pistons, rear. Five chassis modes are street, sport stiff and suspension, loose and traction and stability control, and 50% quicker shifts, track no traction control, even looser stability control, and 160 millisecond shifts, snow mode 5058 WD torque split, and tow mode, which activates trailer sway control. The Durango SRT comes with active noise control, a first for the model. The function works full-time in tow mode, keeping the engine quiet for the third row even under heavy throttle. Inside, the SRT treatment includes a hand-wrapped stitched wheel, performance steering wheel with paddle shifters, wrapped pillars and a suede headliner, beats performance audio and a new Uconnect center console head unit with enhanced graphics. An optional premium interior adds Laguna leather, either all black or red and black. There's an optional center console for the standard Secondro captain's chairs. The Dodge Durango was once rumored to be on the cutting block a few years ago, but with SUV segments dominating the U.S. auto market, the Threro Charger has a better future as a halo model than the five-passenger Charger is a Durango Hellcat next. 2018 Dodge Durango SRT specifications on sale summer 2017 price $62,000 base. A state engine 6.4 liter row HV 16 valve V8475 HP at 6,000 revolutions per minute, 470 lbft. At 4,300 revolutions per minute transmission 8 speed automatic layout 4 door, 6 passenger, front engine 4 WD SUV EPA mileage NA LXWX H189.8 by 84.8 by 67.6 in wheelbase 119.8 in weight 060 miles per hour not top speed 4.4 seconds show more